Hey everyone, Mr. Sujano here. Flycast, a very well-known Sega Dreamcast emulator, just got a huge update. Let's get started. All right, to kick things off, Flycast keeps getting better and better as a Sega Dreamcast emulator, and well, today is absolutely no different. The improvements keep coming. If you've been having performance issues on PC using Flycast, you might be happy with this announcement. So on Twitter today, Libretro tweeted out the best Dreamcast emulator just got even better. Flycast now has a direct 3D11 renderer, ideal for Xbox and Windows users. You can get this version right now from RetroArch's online core updater, and it's also available on Steam. So here's RetroArch up and running. If you're using Flycast to make sure you've got the latest version of it, just head down on the main menu to where it says online updater. And from here, go to update installed cores and hit enter. And that's about it. Now, if you wanted to make sure you're using Direct3D11, just go to the settings menu, go to drivers here and go down to video. It might say GL, it might say Vulcan, just change it to D3D11 and you should be good to go. Now, if you're using the Steam version of RetroArch, all you have to do is make sure your DLC for Flycast is up to date. Now, this might seem like a small or insignificant update, but I will say there are systems out there that struggle with OpenGL compatibility, and there are definitely systems out there that struggle with Vulcan compatibility. So to see the Direct 3D 11 option available on Flycast is a pretty big thing. At the end of the day here, I love seeing updates like this in terms of compatibility. This will probably help out quite a few people who were struggling on PC with Flycast before. Anyways, that is all I've got for this video. Let me know your thoughts about Flycast in the comments below. If you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't like this video, leave a like. Hit that subscribe button, check out my other videos. Thank you everyone, take care.